couldn't be more apropos. Hi, morning, uh, good evening, Jeff. Um, tonight we have Jeff Galati, who's an associate professor of political science, and I can't think of a more appropriate guest uh, for a day in which the uh, federal government I is shut down. Uh, yeah. You know? Yeah, it's uh, 800,000 uh, federal workers um, are not coming to work. Um, there are a few that are made to come to work because they're considered essential. Uh, they, they're not getting paid. Um, maybe they will later on, but it's also the day that uh, Obamacare rolls out uh, where uh, individuals who do not have health insurance uh, have to get health, health insurance and they go to the exchanges in various states uh, to sign up. And I've heard today that uh, the website is uh, having trouble. Um, uh, healthcare.gov is where you're supposed to go to try to get um, health insurance or to shop. Today's really a day to start shopping for uh, health insurance. So we don't know if there are a bunch of glitches on, online or are we just, are, are there just so many people that are, are trying to get uh, health insurance today that are causing problems? Well, or is somebody sabotaging the site? <laughs> I didn't think about that one, but you could be right. <laughs> I mean, uh, what, what are the implications of shutting down the government? Well, it's a big financial, uh, the, the financial implications are, are great. Uh, in, uh, in Washington, D.C. alone, $200 million are, are being lost. And th this is not just federal workers. These are the people that service uh, the federal government, the taxi cab drivers, the uh, sandwich shop owners, uh, food truck owners, uh, all the people in, in, in that work uh, in, the, in the area. Uh, Washington DC should be losing a billion dollars a week um, the economy uh, there but it affects uh, it affects all of us uh, uh, it's estimated that about uh, for every month that we have a shutdown of course I don't expect the shutdown to last that long but we're looking about a, about a 0.15 drop in GDP just from a government shutdown I mean it's interesting I didn't expect the shutdown to